I'd like to welcome everybody to Move his our, uh, March, our March meeting. Call the roll, Mr. Bassett. Mr. Jewell. Present. Mrs. McIntosh. Here. Mrs. Miller. Here. Mrs. Milligan. Here. And Mrs. Morris. Here. I'd like to ask everybody to stand for the pledge of allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. At this time, I'll turn it over to Dr. Bell for a student recognition program. Thank you, Mr. Jewell. We're going to have two presentations tonight. The first one will be by Mr. Hammock, talk about the uh, theater arts presentations. Good evening and thank you. Um, as you said, my name is Quentin Hammock. I uh, oversee all the theatrical productions here at Carlisle. And um, I, so I direct the high school shows. I also produce our junior program, which we wanted to recognize tonight. Pretty much all of them are in extra, other extracurriculars, so I don't know if I see any of them here tonight, but I'm gonna call their names anyway. So if they're here, uh, go ahead and come on down. We'll recognize you really quick, and then I'll talk really quick about the high school show in just a second. So first we have uh, Madison Temple. And then we have Bella Brown, Aiden Leif, uh, Braxton Miller, uh, Ashton Pelfrey, and Hayden Cottrell, Ryland Dalton, and Molly Snyder. And so those are our seventh and eighth grade students. They participated in Frozen Junior just a few weeks ago. We wrapped that. Um, and we're really proud of them. We wanted to recognize them. Um, we honestly come in, came into that show with the same kind of expectations we have for our high school students and they just rose to the occasion and did a really great job. I wanted to uh, recognize them and then also wanted to plug our uh, high school show which is about a month away, we're about five weeks out. Um, we're doing Sis Track this year, it's right here in this room. Um, we're deep into rehearsals, uh, getting re we have more one tonight actually, we're getting ready to start our full run so um, really exciting time. If you haven't come out and, and uh, seen one of our shows, I encourage you to do so. We have a lot of talent here in Carlisle and um, we'd love to see you. So. Thank you. Thank you, Quinn. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Next, we have Mr. Mike Milner, Alden Brown Elementary School Principal. You can take it sure. home. Sure. Put it back. I will. Take it home. Okay. <laughs> Good evening, everybody. I said this is just like a classroom. Everybody sits way back there, and this is where the teachers would be way up here, I guess. So, good evening. Thank you. Uh, Parents, boys and girls, thank you, board, for uh, allowing me to come out and, and recognize some of our younger elementary students. I decided when they asked me to do some recognition tonight to recognize two, two different groups of students. Um, so I'm going to uh, bring up one group, and we're going to kind of line up along here, and then I'll let them get seated, and then I'll bring up a second group and let them line up along here. We can, get, we can have a couple seconds. Our parents may want pictures. The board members will be waving in the background or whatever from there. So the first group I want to recognize, uh, these are students in kindergarten, first, second, or third grade who had perfect attendance through the entire first semester. Um, perfect attendance is always tough to get, we know that. Um, however, you know, given how we've, what we've all gone through the last couple of years, it's even more impressive that uh, moms and dads, you got boys and girls up, and, and the boys and girls were up and here every day. So I want to recognize them to come on up. I have a certificate for them. Um, so I'll give you a certificate, boys and girls, and you're just going to line up here. So come on up. We can, why don't we get everybody up here, and then we'll do a big round of applause at the end if we can, okay? I'm going to start off with Ashlyn Fleck. Come on up. Tessa Fleck, Beckett Glover, Christopher Likens, hey girls, go right down here, a little ways, thank you, Brian Allen, is Brian here, yeah, come right over here guys, good job, Lincoln Burris, I know, this never fails. You do perfect attendance, and this is what happens. But there's lots of people who have lots of stuff going on, so we understand that. Mason Hatfield. Is Mason here? Okay. Jade Likens. I saw Jade. I know she's here. Here she comes. Okay. Is that Mason? Here he comes. Okay. 
Aiden Weber. I saw Aiden. Come on over here. Good job, guys. If I lose this, I won't be able to do the rest of them here. Aiden's coming. Zoe Zarecki. CJ Lips. Okay. Charlie Agnew. I saw Charlie. Harper Allen. Come on, Charlie. Come on. There you go, sweetie. Walk on over there. Good job. Harper, is that you? Okay, come on down. Good job. Come on over here, sweetie. Come here, babe. Yep. Sawyer Burris. Levi Day. Dakota Kurtzels. Case and Lamb. Oh, here comes Dakota. Emery Rogers. Here, buddy. Ty Seaborn. I saw him coming in here. There he is. And Emma Spiegel. And Brayson Wages. I saw him too. All right, there's Ty. Emma. Where's Emma? Brayson. What's your name, sweetie? Emma who? Oh, wait, I gave you the wrong one. What's your name, sweetie? Emery. There we go. Emery and Emma got me confused there. There we go. <laughs> All right, let me get on the end here. All right, everybody, look out here. I bet moms and dads, maybe they got phones up. Everybody smile, wave, maybe. <laughs> you guys, I'm really impressed. I hope you kept your perfect attendance going until now. I'm not sure if they did or not, but I bet they, they probably did. Okay. Everybody okay? All right. Let's give these guys a round of applause. Awesome job. And moms and dads. <laughs> Go ahead, you guys. You want to step here and help me with the next group? No, they're going back. Okay. <laughs> Good job. All right. So the second group I wanted to recognize, and there's actually a couple people in both of these groups I noticed as I was putting this together. The next group I wanted to recognize has to do with our character word that we're doing at the elementary each month. Um, as part of our PBIS, Positive Behavior Intervention Supports Program, each month we have a word, a character word that we're focusing on here on the elementary side. Um, this, the word in February was fairness. And so we talk about it a lot in the morning announcements and in the classrooms and things, whatever the word of the month is. But then um, Mrs. Rylick, our elementary counselor, had, a, had an idea several months ago. She said, She's going to put a um, recognition box and some Yahoo statements, I think she called them or something like that, and so that if adults see kids exhibiting the character words, they can write it up, put it in the box, and then at the end of the month, she recognizes um, those students. So these students have already been recognized by her, but I thought since I was coming to the board meeting, I would recognize this group for this as well. So all these boys and girls that I'm going to call up right now, and I don't have a certificate because you've already gotten something, have exhibited fairness. They were nominated by an adult during February. Okay, so we'll do the same thing. We'll come up and line up here, and then we'll give them a big round of applause. They all exhibited fairness. Here we go. Taj Cardwell. Jade Rourke. Bentley Doss. Here, oh, here comes Jade over here. Here comes Bentley. Come on up here, guys. Yeah, go right down here, Bentley. Stand right in there by Jade. Very good. J.J. Rourke. JJ, Ryan Paris, Cash Collier, Silas Camp, Jade, Jade, just let him go. This is my list, buddy. Just stand right here, Ryan. You're good. <laughs> Mackenzie Fannin. <coughs> come. Here, Silas, come over here, but yeah, right down here. There he goes. Yeah, just stand right here, guys. Staying in a big line. Very good. Mackenzie Fannin, Paisley Dean, Chloe uh, Fort or Forte? Sorry, I think it's Fort. You, is it Fort or Forte? Fort? Fort. There we go. You stay. I'm going to walk to the other side. We'll start lining up down here. Liam Hilton. Comes Liam. Hey, slide down this way, guys. Everybody. <whistles> Lily Pollard. Lucy Baker. 
Emma Emma Spiegel is back, I believe, yeah. Kamaya Stokes. Annabelle Ball. Oh, good. Joseph Desch. Right here, sweetie. All right. Ivy Evans. Right here, buddy. Good job. Elyria Givens. Sawyer Lebrentz. Luna Pika, Eli Richards, Gavin Schaus, Faith Thomas, Seth Green, James Younger, Titan Seaborn is back for another one, Tristan Wiley, Ryder Lakes, Vincent Turner, find a spot, you guys. Caitlin Sims, and Isla Holbrook. We'll wait till everybody gets down here, then we'll give them a big round of applause and we can have pictures at the ready. Good. Okay, everybody smile. Wait a minute, hold on. I got one person I didn't I, I just saw someone on my list. Zeke Estes. Zeke, how did I forget you get on down here? I'm looking out, I'm like, Zeke's gotta be here. Hold on. Hold on just a second, JJ. Come on, Zeke. Right here, buddy. Man, I don't know what what was Mr. Moner thinking right there? I don't know. Now we're all down here. Let's give a round of applause. These are, these kids all exhibited fairness. Good job. So can take your picture. Boys and girls, thank you for exhibiting fairness. Each month, listen to the words, and let's keep exhibiting those characteristics. Thanks you, Mom and Dads, for instilling that in them. Okay, you guys can go sit back down. Thank you very much. All right. Zeke, you already got a certificate. Go sit back. <laughs> you want to tell them they can leave? All right. I'm, I know I want them to stay. <laughs> thank you, Mr. Milner. Thank you very much. Certainly want to commend all the people that were recognized tonight. Uh, we'll try and get with um, Beth Callahan and make sure we get that post and we'll get it on our website as well. At this time, parents and students are more than welcome to stay, but if you can find anything better to do, you're more than welcome to leave at this time. <laughs> I'm not waiting around to clean these tables up either. Not waiting around. As soon as the meeting's over, I'm starting to clean up. Well, we don't have that meeting after the meeting, so we don't have to worry about it. No. Unless you want to. Unless you So what? There you go. Hey, I'll get with you and get, send those names. Each one of uh, groups to Sheila. If you're still here, you have to sit down and join the meeting. His last name is Fish. I thought they said Estes. He has a big last name. All right. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. Ready? Ready? Yeah. At this time, uh, We've got a place reserved for visitors' comments. If uh, we have any visitor that wants to uh, make any comments, come up to the mic here. If not, I'll turn it over to Mr. Basser, the Treasury Report. Thank you, Mr. Jewell. Uh, one non-action item for me this month, audit report. Uh, found out on Friday that our audit is complete. It's not completely filed complete, but the audit itself is complete. Uh, we have to file the report yet for it to be completely finished. 
and uh, you all will be notified via email uh, through that report. Uh, but I can happily say that the, the audit is done and there are no findings uh, on the audit. So I'll be listed as a clean audit uh, again for this year. So uh, I'm, I'm very happy for my staff. Um, it's a long drawn out process. You know, we basically start in July getting stuff ready for the audit. And as you can see, it's the end of March. Uh, so we'll take a couple months off from our audit process and then <laughs> be, be ready to start up again in July uh, to audit this year's stuff. But uh, really excited, A, to have it done, and probably even more excited uh, that uh, no findings and another clean audit uh, for uh, our, our treasurer's office. So just wanted to give you that update. Um, like I said, in the next day or two, we'll be filing the report, and then you'll get official <laughs> notification uh, via email as soon as that gets taken care of. So good news on that respect. Action items for the month. I need approval for the minutes for the last regularly scheduled board meeting, which was February the 28th. I need a motion. First by Mrs. Milligan. Second. Second by Mrs. McIntosh. Call the roll, please. Mrs. Milligan. Mrs. McIntosh? Yes. Mr. Jewell? Yes. Mrs. Miller? Yes. Mrs. Morris? Yes. Uh, secondly is my financial, <laughs> financial report. Again, it's part of the packet. Uh, again, we're rolling along. Uh, no surprises. Uh, I, I think we're doing a very good job this year. Uh, revenue has uh, exceeded my uh, predictions so far. I don't know how that's going to put us at the end of the year. Uh, but that's typically good news when you have more revenue than what you expected. Uh, so uh, the, the Fair Funding Act ha has been good to us so far. I'm not in 100% trust in it yet because it's so new. Um, but so far, good news on that end. So I need approval for the financial report. I need a motion. First by Mrs. Morris. Second. Second by Mrs. Milligan. Call the roll, please. Mrs. Morris. Yes. Mrs. Milligan. Yes. Mrs. Miller? Yes. Mrs. McIntosh? Yes. And Mr. Jewell? Yes. And then finally, every March, uh, we do the accept the tax rates and amounts as determined or certified by the Budget Commission of Warren County. Every February, I attend a Budget Commission hearing. I uh, attended that at the end of February. And uh, given our, our rates for uh, the upcoming year, so need board, board approval uh, from those rates. I need a motion. Second. First by Mrs. Uh, Miller. Second by Mrs. Milligan. Call the roll, please. Mrs. Miller? Yes. Mrs. Milligan? Yes. Mrs. Morris? Yes. Mr. Jewell? Yes. And Mrs. McIntosh? Yes. Thank you very much. That's my report for the month. At this time, I'll turn it over to Dr. Bell for the superintendent's report. Thank you. I have a few non action items. Uh, the uh, construction people were in on Friday, March 18th to clean up a few little minor issues working on the parking lot lights that had gone down, the, some of the doors with the mechanicals there, uh, blinds in the LA, and Four Seasons who's been on site two days a week for our preventive maintenance have been uh, very identifiable and doing a lot of stuff that you know keeps Jimmy, doesn't have to do that, changing filters, addressing any other issues we have. So we're glad that we work with them on the environmental or the prevention uh, warranty plan. Thank you. A um, couple things coming up and great to have those kids here for the uh, fairness uh, tribute or trade and as well as the perfect tennis. The other thing we did have was the uh, 31st annual high school student art exhibition that was held in on March 6th. We had a number of students that uh, placed and we'll get those posted on the website as well and get that information to Mrs. Callahan to post on her site. Uh, a couple things coming up. This Friday, we're going to have the Franklin B. Walter Scholarship at the ESC. And uh, Alyssa has been picked as our Franklin B. Walter Scholarship recipient, and she has named Susan Cox as her teacher of um, that has contributed to her success. And so they'll both be honored this Friday. And then also the Area Council of Progress, Warren County, has, uh, they, as I told you, they we had 22 nominations, 12 different staff members, and uh, that uh, we haven't finalized those who the first pick will be. We'll let, let you know as soon as they are made aware, and then they have a uh, recognition on May 4th. So those are all my non-action items. Thank you. Action items, uh, first thing is 
Uh, B1, classified resignations, Jake Branson, custodian, as of 4-15-22. Can I have a motion for that, please? Or approved? Need that approved? So moved. First by Mrs. McIntosh. Second. Second by Mrs. Milligan. Call the roll, please. <coughs> Mrs. McIntosh? Yes. Mrs. Milligan? Yes. Mrs. Morris? Yes. Mrs. Miller? Yes. Mr. Jewell? Yes. Thank you. Item 2, uh, ask for you to approve classified employment. Uh, a, Leslie Leach is classified sub and sub bus driver. And uh, B, Wesley McGuire, sub bus driver, retroactive to March 4th of this year. Need a motion? First by Mrs. Morris. Second. Second by Mrs. Miller. Call a roll, please. Was that Mrs. Miller? Yes. Yeah, second. Mrs. Morris? Yes. Mrs. Miller? Yes. Mr. Jewell? Yes. Mrs. McIntosh? Yes. And Mrs. Milligan? Yes. Thank you. And uh, item three, supplemental employment. You can scratch item B. And so we'll just be voting on three A and C uh, supplemental employment. Rachel Adams is volunteer high school volleyball assistant. And Brooke Adams is volunteer softball coach. Uh, item B, we're just gonna, all the paperwork has not been completed on that one, so we'll probably have that one on the April agenda. Mm -hmm. So we need approval for three A and C, please. Need a motion? So moved. First by Mrs. Miller. Second. Second by Mrs. McIntosh. Call the roll, please. Mrs. Miller? Yes. Mrs. McIntosh? Yes. Mr. Jewell? Yes. Mrs. Milligan? Yes. Mrs. Morris? Yes. Thank you. That's all I have for today. Appreciate it. Thank you. Anything happen at the uh, legislative <coughs> report there you want to report? Nothing that will affect us. <laughs> okay. Do we have any old business? Any new business? Mm -hmm. Then uh, I need a motion for adjournment. So moved. First by Mrs. McIntosh. Second. Second by Mrs. Morris. Call the roll. Mrs. McIntosh? Yes. Mrs. Morris? Yes. Mrs. Milligan? Yes. Mrs. Miller? Yes. Mr. Jewell? Yes. Time is 622.